Dozens of staff and patients have tested positive for COVID at the Queen's Medical Center at Punchbowl. The hospital says it was discovered through widespread testing in response to one positive patient two weeks ago. The nurses' union is calling for more surveillance testing to prevent such outbreaks. Gina Mangieri reports. A patient who tested positive for COVID-19 at Queens in late December led Queens to launch widespread testing, which unveiled clusters totaling 27 caregivers and 12 patients now infected with the virus. Queens said in a statement, all are quarantined and receiving appropriate care. These events are occurring at the same time as a near doubling of the community positive testing rate for COVID. The hospital says it launched widespread testing after the initial positive two weeks ago, and the cases were detected from broad surveillance and measures to avoid patterns of rapid transmission. But the nurses' union says such testing should be routine and not just a crisis response. What we've been advocating for from day one um, back in March was that they do routine surveillance testing of everybody who does frontline um, stuff. Um, that was resisted. They did make testing available free to staff. They can go, but it's kind of um, out of the way, and so it hasn't been utilized by the people because it's, you know, our suggestion is make it convenient for them. Have it right there when they come to work. You want to get tested. The outbreak comes in the midst of the state's vaccine rollout, with many health care workers receiving their first doses around the same time the cluster began to form. Queen says 5,700 caregivers within the Queen's health systems have received the first dose of the vaccine. The second doses are just now getting underway statewide for the earliest vaccine recipients. I get my second one next week. I'm scheduled to go get it. So mm -hmm. um, I would encourage all of our, you know, because we need to set an example because um the only way that i think that we're going to or one of the best ways and the quickest ways that we're going to get a handle on this pandemic is getting a large number of people vaccinated queens adds the well-being of our patients and caregivers is our highest priority we are committed to best practices to ensure we are providing the highest levels of safe compassionate health care to the people of hawaii gina mangeri khon2 news working for hawaii